We got tacos de barbacoa. Who is she? I don't know her. Ooh. And, um, what do you think about girls who go after their friend's ex? Mm. <laughs> que se ponga el zapato, que se lo amarre y que baile en él. Like, like bitch. Bitch. That's in casa. <laughs> that's where all the guys are cheating. Thank you. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be collabing with Alexi. So we're going to do a mukbang for my channel. And then we're going to be going live on her Facebook and next Sunday. So the 21st. So you guys can check it out. And we're going to be going live before 3 p.m. And I'll leave more information down below in the description box. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So today <laughs> we got tacos de barbacoa for my mom. Shout out to my mom. <laughs> Shout out to Luna's mom. It's late out here. And, and then... then this I don't know is, what, this, what was it called? Uh, it was a pepino tropical from La Paleteria Coctemo. Hit them up. It, yeah, it looks pretty up. bomb. The waters were good. So we got yeah. that. We got what was it called? Some. We got. Oh yeah, yeah. No, las waters. Aguas. Las aguas. Yes. Yo agarré de coco y de nuez. Ya me la tragué toda. <laughs> y lo está. No pasa nada. No de caga de pepino, da. ¿no? Yeah, pepino limón. Um, and then we got. I mean. Yeah. I call these story locos, but they called it something else. I don't some know. weird thing. Some weird name. <laughs> and I was like, okay. okay. And then she also has a YouTube channel, so make sure you go subscribe to her channel. It's well, I'm wait, Alexis Aime, right? Yeah. Yeah, Alexis Aime. I'll leave it down in the description box too, so you guys can subscribe to her channel. Yes, guys. Yes. I'm new to YouTube, so like, you I'll guys come better in. go subscribe. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Well, so yeah. it's gonna be a girl talk video. So yeah. Basically, yeah. Girl talk, relationship <laughs> advice, big mm. girl stuff. I'm ah, yeah. just kidding. Stay tuned. Like that. I don't know. Get a cebolla? Just random stuff. No, yeah. no, 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 no. No te gusta la cebolla? No. <laughs> Why? I don't know. I like over here. Like, eating. I like it in some stuff, and, but in other stuff, like, in, I don't like it in tacos. I don't Why? Know. I'm like, <laughs> wishy, I don't know her. Wishy. I know. And then, I just like the, the cilantro. Oh my god, I put way too much. Te vas a cagar. Some salsa. It ain't tacos if you don't got no salsa. Is it spicy? That's true. I don't know. I haven't even tasted it, but... Just to be it. on the safe side. I know. Porque si no... I know. Just gonna stop the video right here. I know. Uh, it's gonna... It's gonna be on the toilet while you're editing. <laughs> I know. Ooh, this look bomb. Shout out to Londa for making the tortillas too. I know. Las fue a calentar y Londa. No, las hizo a mano. I'm just kidding. Uh, just kidding. <laughs> Okay, dude. Just kidding. Ah, wifey. I know. Dude, ah. <laughs> no, you can get married without knowing how to make tortillas. I don't know. True. That's good. This is fire. I don't know where they got the barbacoa from. I think it's just El Radero or something. It's bomb though. It's good. Mm hmm We haven't ate so <laughs> don't mind us. Mm -hmm. We're over here all eating them. <laughs> We're not even talking. <laughs> Hold up. No. Uh. Hold up. Esperemos un momento. A few moments later. What do you think about the whole getting married thing? Like that the girl like you know how like a lot of Mexicans are like being machistas and they think like the girl has to take care of the guy? I think oh uh, personally. Not like just yeah. like the house and like his laundry and stuff. What do you think I about that? I don't think I think it should be half and half, to mm -hmm. be honest. Like, like they should help each other, like make food, do laundry, like. But so you know, like, especially if they both work, like maybe if like the mom is at the house all day and she has time to do stuff, then like she could do it. But like, if he has time, I mean, if they're both working, then like they should be half and half too. But I think the same. Even like with food, I don't know. To me, I feel like, I just feel like everything works out better when it's 50-50. I know. Because if it's, even if it's the guy more than the girl, like, you feel used. And, like, I feel like in a marriage, that wouldn't work. Mm hmm I mean, I know I wouldn't want to be, like, cleaning up someone's underwears every day or, like, washing their clothes. Like, you could you have to be independent, like, of yourself. Yeah, like, just to take care of yourself as a person. Like, just because you get married doesn't mean you have to, like. Doesn't mean the girl has to do everything. Mm-hmm. That, that's what I think too. Like I know like the guys work, but like still like they should help them. Mm -hmm. Like it has to be 50-50. Do you have an age you want to be married by? Mm, probably like, I don't know, like 
29. Hmm. That's a good age. What about you? Married, I think like by like 24. 24? 25. Yeah, I don't really have an age. But I do know like fact is like I want to have like a house before I get married. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like live That's with the true. person first. I don't know. Like it's not really that traditional. Like no matter like you know how they're like oh like to get married like they're on court whatever and you move in after you get married i would want to live with the person first first to see how they are because mm -hmm. you guys could be boyfriend and girlfriend all cute and then you like when it comes to living together you guys just can't do it that's true like i feel like you don't really know a person until like you live with them mm -hmm. or travel with them mm -hmm. yeah neta. give us a second i'm just kidding <laughs> <laughs> but I feel like I'm not gonna be married like real soon here. I'm like, ni tengo novio como me va a casar. So, yeah. I don't know. I've had my boyfriend. I've been with my boyfriend for almost four years. And I love him and everything. And I hope, like, we do get married, but I wouldn't rush it. Like, I wanna travel and, like, do all of that first mm -hmm. and like own things like you know because i feel like once you like have a child it's like a lot of responsibility and like you can't do stuff that you wish you could have done before like having a baby yeah or like it's way harder so like, yeah you know. i mean you can if you like put your mind to it but it's harder yeah or like you just have to delay things because it's like you have a priority mm -hmm. before anything you do i want to do that too yeah, like, I don't know. But, yeah. What do you think about, like, girls? Like, talking about that with, like, dating. What do you think about girls who go after their friend's ex? Mm. <laughs> well, why are you laughing? Because <laughs> I've had friends that have done that before. To you? Yes. Can they just f*** them? No. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God! <laughs> que se ponga el zapato, que se lo amarre y que baile en él, pues. <laughs> So like one time I had like uploaded a video with like my ex, like a cute little video of us too. Really? <laughs> and then like um like she commented, You guys are so cute. And that was like when okay, I like when we were dating or whatever. And then we broke up and then like yeah, like tiempo pasó. Well not that much time but like tiempo pasó. And then afterwards like <coughs> she started like talking <coughs> to him. And like I, she, I knew because like she would post him and stuff, and like I'm like, are you serious? You just said we were cute, and now you're dating him, like. And I'm pretty sure she knew I still wasn't over him, and like she still did that. I'm like, hmm, I don't know. Him. That's messed up. Like honestly, it's not rocket science. Like it's literally just girl code. Like you can't go after your friend's ex. Like even if I feel like I was single and I was in the position to. Where, like, even a guy that my friend just talked to would try to get at me, I feel like I wouldn't do it. Yeah, I wouldn't do it either, but... Because that's, like, their seconds. Like, what the heck? Over here tasting homegirls' babas and stuff. And, oh, like, good. especially if you, like... I feel like she acted like she didn't know that he was my ex, but she did. Like, she even commented on it. She clearly saw yeah. a video and commented. She clearly said, you guys are so cute. But low-key, I knew she thought he was cute. That's why she posted that. I don't know. I feel like I would just... I could never like I feel like to me it's like once your friend talks to a guy or like shares like any sort of intimacy with the guy I'm like ew like that's yeah. like my friends like ew and, and there's so like many hombres and up. so much chile like the whole, like <laughs> you don't need to do that it's messed up to do that to your friend like especially if like you know like that that friend liked like his ex liked her ex a lot like yeah or like was all into him yeah like she that's messed up. she knew that i freaking liked him still like and she still did that but it's whatever yucky <laughs> no but like this has happened to me like a lot of times well not a lot of times but like the other t like a long time ago mm -hmm. i went to a quince with my friend and then i told her hey that's the guy that i like mm -hmm. and then like um so we were like in like inside we were all talking and like she was talking to him too because like we were all talking in grupo and then like a week later he had her he had her as her cover his cover <laughs> i was like i clearly like she didn't say like she didn't put him as his her cover but like it's you obvious that they're talking yeah mm -hmm. like and i was just like what the what that's the retarded oh literally that's why 
honestly, I don't trust anybody. Like, yeah, I don't that's why it's better not even to put your business out there. I know. Yeah, because I feel like if me and like at the beginning, like if me and my boyfriend would have posted more about like our relationship, I feel like I don't know. It just like it's really not healthy. Like, it gives people room to talk or to assume or to like estar ahí entre metidos. So it's just better for to have that stuff in private. Because yeah. then if you get played, at least it's in private, you know? That's true. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. That's why, like, I don't know. I feel like if I start talking to someone again mm -hmm. soon, like, I feel like I'll keep it low-key. Until I know, like, it's for real, you know? Yeah, until you have that Instagram, that Facebook, and that Twitter password. Yes, Snapchat, honestly. Snapchat. That's where all the guys be cheating. Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> That's where all the guys be cheating. <laughs> I'm like, every time I say a bad word, I'm like, You're like, Ugh, sorry. <laughs> but then I don't know. I feel like that make that also makes a guy like feel like think like think that like you're the one playing them. También, because if like you don't post them, he's probably gonna like assume like why isn't she posting? Me? Like you know what I mean? So it's kind of like, what do you do? It should what go do you on do both at that point? Yeah. Like what do you do at that point? Do you just tell them about it or what? like most important thing in relationships is like the communication so like if it is to that point where you guys know you're exclusive and everything like you have to have that conversation about like yo like you know because really because that's i feel like that's like everyone's problem with their relationship is like i don't know how to tell him this or with the guy too I, how do i ask her this or like you know mm -hmm. it's just communication and that's really the key to a long relationship or like, I don't know, like, también, like, you know how, like, when you start talking to someone, it's like right away chismes or everybody has someone to tell you oh, about yeah. that person. You can't listen to them either. Like, you have to be willing to put, like, your pride aside and ask the person, like, yo, this or that. That's true. Bien wise, yo. Bien wise, yo. Oh, my. Oh. <laughs> oh. And And I, oh. I, I like your advice. Look at my stuff. Thank you. <laughs> well, yeah, just because I feel like I've been in a relationship for like a long time, like I feel like it's cool because there's people driving. I know they were just looking at us, and I was like, <laughs> like I really got into grow with my boyfriend, so it's like cool that like you kind of know how it is, and like I feel like it's cool to do to be like that because then I could be like, oh yeah, like just continue. Mm -hmm. That's true, but like. How you said like communication is key, like, but it's like it has to be from both parts because yeah, because it just can't be one it person can't just either. Be one person. Yeah, and you can't be the the one person. You can't be the only person in the relationship giving it your all, because then, like, it's the not has, out, you just yeah. get tired of people. And that, that's why a lot of people like they'll have a good thing and they ruin it because they put too much pride, or they just think about it, cause like. Or think about it That's like true. too much and don't act on like you know what they want or speak on it or like anything like that and that's like the most important part of a relationship and also like be honest like if something is bugging you like tell them or like mm -hmm. ask them if it's bugging you like like if they don't want to say it then like that's on them but like you at least try to ask them about it yeah for real and um like with that I totally brain farted but like <laughs> What was I gonna say? <laughs> I, don't know. I totally Let's go like back. Just it. Wait, I know. Wait, what did you say? What did I say? Oh, that you have to be like honest about stuff. Like if something is bothering you. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Them. I saw you about like <laughs> if, whether or not like you like something, you have to do it. Si les vas a reclamar or like anything like that, you have to do it in a good way. Cause tampoco like I don't think it's cute when girls go off on their man. Like that is so I ugly. Know. Like stop. Like you have to like be calm. Like when you tell them, like don't be like, like screaming fucking, at them. It's like you're a person, not a fucking slave or like someone who has to answer to you. You know what like, I mean? Menos les van a hacer caso si están ahí gritando. Yeah, like it doesn't work. Uh, puros golpes. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm not like that girl that everyone's like, oh, she's always with her boyfriend. Like I am, but at the same time, like, procuro tener amistades or like to have my own stuff apart from him too. Because you, like, with that, you can get tired of a person. Like, you need your own space, your own time, your That's own true. interest. 
like stuff so you can bring like different things to talk about because if you guys are together all the time like like what are you gonna talk about <laughs> just kidding yeah oh did you see that ant move like no <laughs> like that's freaking boring yeah like she said like don't just make it be all about them like you also like spend time with your family you're like with your friends because like if that person does decide to leave you like who's gonna be there like your family is or your friends like they're the ones that are gonna be like there to like put your head up and stuff but like if you're just with that person then it's gonna be harder for you to get over it yeah and i don't know i i've never been through a bad breakup but you always have to be ready because you never know nowadays so like with that like keep your family keep your friends keep your own interest because what cuando haces like yeah it's it's okay to give that person importance but like give them their space and give your friends and the other things their space and their time too or su lugar you know mm -hmm. because then you lose that person and you lose everything yeah. you know what i mean and like, it can't be like that like you have to bounce back it's freaking hot girl season i don't know but <laughs> <laughs> like you can't depend on that person to always be there for you or be your yeah. happiness like you have to find happiness in other things and for yourself because that's what that's freaking whack like ugh. Cause that will mess you up like if you depend your happiness on somebody like the whole time like for a long time it's gonna mess you up so yeah, much like, like you're gonna be like Ugh. like no mm -hmm. one's even gonna want to be around you because you're all sad i'm just kidding because <laughs> you're all sad <laughs> well that ice cream is sweet it's good though okay i didn't oh i'm okay <laughs> i don't know that's good though this mm -hmm. ice cream is good the mango one I love squinkless. Same. Dude, this is pretty bomb. That has to be fire too. It's Don't probably all aguadas. Like I know. <laughs> it's okay. Honestly, it tastes bomb even aguada. Mm hmm. Why something? Oh, did you hear that? What was that? A candy. In Chion. What was it? One of these three only. That was hard. <laughs> Can you tell her paisa? I know. What's your favorite thing to do? Like, just like when you want to have fun. Mm. Hold up, let me finish eating this. Mm. I like to like go out to eat with my friends. Or like, mm. I don't know, like I always want to do like, like fun stuff, like not just go eat but like go to the park like right, go ride bikes or like do something different you know but nobody ever wants to <laughs> yeah, yeah. <I> just <laughs> people be wow no but really some people don't really want to mm -mm. or like i hate people like they're never down to do no things like it's always like una peda or like yeah. which is fine like it's fine like that's fun too but like that's the only thing not you know what i do for fun you know i don't what do you think about weed I mean, I think that like some people use it for like themselves, like if they have like anxiety and stuff like that. Yeah. And like to help them. So I I don't think it's bad if they use it for like to feel better. But like, I mean, like I feel like probably they should. I mean, I feel like smoking cigarettes is way worse than smoking weed. So like if you're gonna smoke, then I feel like people should rather like smoke weed <laughs> than cigarettes. Cause like cigarettes is like it f***s up your well it messes up <laughs> hold up <laughs> it messes up your pulmones and stuff and like that's like ca cancer guaranteed yeah so I feel like yeah I mean if people want to do it then it's up to them yeah like I'm not gonna tell you don't do it like do your thing boo yeah I just feel like with everything it's good in moderation. Like, I don't know, like, to me, like, it would be kind of hard to respect someone who smokes, like, before work. That they oh, have yeah. to eat, to smoke, to get an appetite and all that shit. I'm like, okay, crackhead. <laughs> you know? This guy's all passing by. He's like, what the heck is Nah, he don't care. He's just like, whatever. But, yeah, I feel like everything's good in moderation. Because, like, if you're just smoking to get high, like, every single day, like, are you even enjoying it? Like, you're just getting high. Mm hmm that's what it is to me at least because like i don't know i feel like and then if you like something and it's like something you enjoy like you want to keep it to be something para despegarte not to just be like a habit that's true 
Because a lot of people do make it a habit of like doing every every day. Ugh. And like that's cool. Like if you want to smoke weed every day, cool. But like for me, I just wouldn't be able to do it. And it, it's hard for me to respect people who do that. Because like, I'm like, you like being open all day? <laughs> like, you know? Because really, they're all... Huh? Yeah. Like, bitch. Like, ni estás en casa. <laughs> Just... Yeah, like, they're all like... In the little world. In La La Land all day and shit. I don't know. <laughs> That's what it is to me, and I don't know. All right, guys, so we're just gonna end the video here because the lighting is going down on us. The lighting, <laughs> the lightning. Just the kidding. Sun. I'm just kidding. The sun is going down on us, so it's not gonna look that good. So we're just gonna end the video here. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to go subscribe to her channel. I'll have a link down below, and make sure you subscribe to my channel too and give it a big thumbs up if you like this video. And if you wanna see more videos with us, comment down below. Let us know, guys. Yeah. We're down. Pero ya. Yeah. Yes. and stay tuned um, oh, yeah, yeah. look down below um, we'll have more info about us going live on Facebook and possibly doing a 5 minute makeup challenge or something related yeah so make sure you guys check that out yes okay, bye. thank you guys bye